to understand the game place analysis question uh, analysis 2 so uh, we have already um, uh, solved the question game play analysis 1 and let me try to make you understand about the tables and uh, which columns uh, the table consists of so this uh, we are having one table activity and that table consists of four column player id device id event date and games played here player id and event date are com uh, com with combined they are the primary key of this table so and what we need to find out we need to find out we need to write a sql query to report the device that is first login for each player so let's try to understand it so let's suppose one player id ha was logged in on uh, 2016 and, and 3 and 0 1 and he ag again logged in in 2016 5 and 0 2 so for the device id 2 he he, the, he he logged in for the first time right so uh, so for the player id uh, 1 the uh, output will be device id 2 so uh, let's try to understand by this example so for, for player id 3 he or she has logged in on uh, in the month of third march in the in the month of march or oh, and she has also logged in in the month of uh, in the month of in the month of july sorry i was just calculating it so, okay so the for player id 2 the the device id which was first logged in is 1 right so for player id uh, 1 it, the answer will be 2 for as the player id 2 has only logged in one only one so the answer will be 3 and for the player id 3 it will answer will be 1 okay so how can we solve it so uh, we can solve it using uh, uh using windows and that's very easy concept in uh that's very easy concept in sql world so what we can do we can create one new column and we can name it as rank and we can just give uh we can uh, partitions by uh, on this player id and then we can find the, which one is the minimum uh, event date so if I do the partitions by, then for this player ID one, it will give me dense rank function will give this uh, for this event date as one, and for this event date it will give me two. Likewise for this three, if I partitions by, then the minimum date the first date is this, and the, uh, the first date is this, and the second date is this, right? So the, so I will be having uh, one, and then for this particular row I will be having two. So let me just try to uh, show the uh, show the table that will make more sense to you. I've already copied this thing. So what we wanted to achieve uh, using uh, the rank functions. So I've already uh, created one uh, example. Uh, I've already uh, created the output and for the, uh, for showing it to you. So let me just write the query first. That will make more sense. So for getting this this intermediary table, what we can write, we can write select player ID, device ID, event date, and we can write dense rank and then we can do over and we can do partition by uh, on which column we will be doing the partition by we will be doing the partition by on player id because we want to find that which which device uh, was logged in by logged in by that particular person right so we'll be doing the partition by by player id okay and then we uh, on order by clause we will be doing on event date cool and the event date will be ascending right and let's call this uh, this column as rank rnk from activity 
right so this table uh, when we run this particular query uh, this will uh, let's just pass games played also event date games played we don't need games played but let's just pass it not a problem okay so we will be getting this particular intermediary table what we can do now we can just write select and we can use the with clause we can use the with clause with and we can create one intermediary or uh, temporary table or virtual table let me just refactor it little bit okay so this particular table will give me this result and i wanted this particular output in the in the for this particular final output so what i can do i can write player id comma device id from rank table I have created rank table using with column, uh, sorry, not with, uh, using with statement. And I can write, and what I need to write, where rnk, that is the rank column I we have created, is equal to 1. So for player id 1, this will be the result. For 2, this will be the result, like 2 or 3. And for the player id 3, this will be the result, right? Okay, let's just copy this code and let's try to run it. I'm just just one minute let me just copy it here also so that I can copy it I can copy it in one go cool let's just we will check if there is any syntax error let's just run it okay everything is cool let's submit it okay so we have solved this problem uh, if there is any doubt feel free to comment uh, we will try to explain in the comment sections too thank thank you for uh, going through this video thank you